I hope. Nice. You got it? All right, I'm Keith McNally, media whore. So when Big Jim is like, can I interview you? I was like, well, of course, anytime, any place. As we speak, I don't know so, exactly where we are. We're near Astor Place, and so it is So did my morning. cock feel really good in through your throat? I, not at first. At first, I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. That's, it's <laughs> Big Jim, right? I knew what I was getting into. Right, 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 right. It hurt a lot, but it's one of those hurts that when I'm an 80-year-old man and I look back, I'm going to be like, that was good, man. So like uh, Canada, man, right? Canada's for the win. Last week I would have told you that, but now that everyone is in New York, New York's fun again. That's all it takes is keeping the girl fans showing up, and I love it here. That's what tricked me. It was me I thought I would like living here. Let me ask you this. Huh? What one keeping the girl fan from Texas uh-huh. makes you want to stay in America? That would have to probably be Big Jim. Oh, really? <laughs> really? <someone>. Really? <laughs> oh my God. I love you, McNally. I love you too, Big Jim. Oh, that's fucking great.